Hey guys, welcome to my channel. For today's video, I have the Ipsy Glam Bag for October 2020. If you're unfamiliar with the Ipsy Glam Bag, it is a $12 a month beauty subscription. You're guaranteed five deluxe sample size items and you're supposed to get $50 worth of product. Sometimes that happens, sometimes it doesn't. But we're gonna go ahead and get into it today. But before we do, if you are new here, hello, my name is Emily or M-E-G, whatever you wanna call me. I do both beauty and fashion related content on my channel. So if that sounds interesting to you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Let's go ahead and get into the bag. So this month I actually had two items outside my bag, so let me go ahead and show you guys that. The first item is the Pura Face Dermal Purifying Sheet Mask, and this appears to be a set of two sheet masks, so this is probably a full-size item. And this has niacinamide in it, so it's going to brighten your skin, and niacinamide is a really good ingredient, generally speaking, for your skin to help brightening it and smoothing out skin textures. So I am excited to try these out and I'm happy that I got two of them and not just one. The other item I had outside of my bag is the item I chose. This is from SL Miss Glam. It is one of their brushes. Here is the brush. This is also full size. I'll have to look at the prices and see if there's a card in there. I didn't check. But it is just a really cute little green brush. I like it. I like that it's got the sparkle in it, which SL Miss Glam always does. They're not the softest bristles in my opinion, but they're definitely not bad. This is their round blush P40 brush. I would probably use this more so for highlighter. This isn't really big enough for me to use as a blush brush. I like something really big and fluffy, but I'll definitely use this for highlighter and I just love getting brushes because I hate cleaning them. So happy to have this. Now let's get into the actual bag. I think the bag this month is super cute. It's got the little embossed gold on here and then it says your magic on the back. And the thing that makes this bag for me is literally this little charm. I think this is so freaking cute with the moon and the star adorable. Oh, we do have product information this month. So I guess we're getting product information in the regular glam bag, but not the plus. Maybe we're not getting in the plus because we pick three of the items. That's my best guess. I'm not 100% sure. So the sheet masks are $14.99 for the both of them. And then you're going to use this for 15 to 20 minutes. It also has collagen in it apparently and aloe vera as well. And the brush retails for $18.50. So the first item actually inside my bag is from Oriza, and this is their Astral Amethyst Shimmer Eyeshadow. This is a quad and this is apparently full size and it retails for $20. This retails for $20, okay. I just find it very hard to believe that this retails for $20, but whatever. Here is the little eyeshadow quad. So you get three shimmers and one matte. I think it looks better in the picture, in my opinion, than it does in person. In the picture, the brown shade looks a little bit more on like the purpley side. All right, so to be honest, these shades are not swatching very impressively. Like, they kind of look like nothing. I'm gonna try not to prejudge them before they're on the eyes, but the matte is probably the most pigmented. These shimmers are not really showing up a whole lot. I will definitely play with it and see how it looks on the eyes. I'm not gonna say that it's not good yet. Maybe I'll try it out a little bit in my Ipsy try on video, which I'll probably film soon. The next item I have is from Essence and this is their Pure Nude Highlighter. And this is a deluxe sample. This is really nice packaging actually. I'm kind of surprised. Essence is such a cheap makeup brand, which they have good products. That's not what I'm knocking. I'm just like surprised it's in like somewhat nice packaging. Like I thought it would be a little cheaper feeling to be honest, but there is the highlighter. That's really pretty. I love gold highlighters. I'm very excited about this. Now if you guys can see that, but I love gold highlighters and this is a pretty gold, gold highlighter. So I'm actually pretty excited about that. And the last item that came in here, oh my God, this is freaking tiny. Look at that. That is literally smaller than my pinky. Anyways, this is the Tarte Maracuja Tinted Hydrator in Fair Neutral. So this is probably like a tinted moisturizer, like a BB cream or something like that. And the full size is $29. The full size of the highlighter is $9.99 by the way. Just says it's a lightweight, blendable, buildable formula. This is just so small. I probably will be able to use this once, maybe twice if I'm lucky. Okay guys, so I will say this month, I definitely think we hit over the $50 value. We have the $20 palette, the $18.50 brush, the $14.99, sheet masks the highlighter this would be about a dollar 
20-ish worth of product because the full size is 30 grams and this is 3.3. So it's gonna be a little over a dollar's worth of product. And then this full size will be $29 at 30 milliliters. And this is five milliliters. So this is gonna be like just under $5 worth of product. So you're gonna be getting around a $59, $60 value this month, at least with my bag. So that's a pretty good value. The last few months I have had under $50. So I'm happy that this month they hit that mark. Overall, I have to say, I think this bag was really good. I like everything I got. I do think that this is tiny and I will have to try this out. But the other three I'm pretty excited about. I love getting sheet masks, especially because these look like Korean brands brand sheet masks yes they are I was right I can tell at this point if something is a Korean brand sheet mask because I've had so many there's a way that they do their packaging and a way that they put everything together that makes me know if it's a Korean brand I know that sounds really weird but it's really easy for me to distinct very quickly if it is a Korean brand item. I love Korean brand sheet masks. I love brushes. I love highlighters. I do like tinted moisturizers. I just think that's very small, but I still will try it out and see what I think of it. All right, guys. So let me know down in the comments what you thought of my bag and what you got in your Ipsy this month. If you do get Ipsy, I would love to hear about it. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up before you go. And don't forget to click that subscribe button as well. That is all for today, guys. Stay safe, stay healthy, and have a good one. Bye, guys.